Hello, back again with another 60 plus ways to use your paper strips that are one inch or less. Tonight is round seven, part 81. So we're doing um, 401 through 405. Alrighty, so first up for tonight is a heart border embellishment. And I've made them into a card. I made two different heart borders, this one and a smaller version. So you can see if you do two of them, they look rather cute together, don't they? Alrighty, so a heart border, very, very simple. And you can put as many hearts on as you want. Alrighty, the next one is, um, these are called two strips and a rectangle. Two strips and a rectangle embellishment. My mind kind of went off there somewhere. <laughs> so two strips and a rectangle. And this one I added a circle to. Two strips and a rectangle. That looks more square, but that's okay. Two strips and a rectangle. Isn't that easy? So and it doesn't matter what size. You just need the two strips to cross over each other like that. Okay? And yes, I made one of them into a card. And you can see it here. And here's the two strips and the rectangle. Alrighty. The next one is a bow negative card. I've been playing with my bow punches. Or my bow punch, I should say. And I used the negative and I made it into a card. Alrighty. And the next one is a trading card, an art trading card with a side shape. So art trading cards, and then just add some, a little something on the side. I just took a, a scallop circle and cut it in half and put it on there. Isn't that neat? So and you can use any of your, any shape. You could do a little triangle there. <clears throat> you could do a square, whatever shape you want. Just put up. Stick it a little behind there and add it to it. Alrighty. And then last but not least, I got a little carried away on this last one because I made I've made four different four more different trading cards for you. Just so that you can see how many different types of trading cards. And I was trying to get through my green scraps. So so here's another trading card here. And I just did steps on it. Isn't that easy? And I had this piece of ribbon that matched, so I put that on and the little strip there that fit and then I use the birdhouse and there is a video on the birdhouse I'll try to remember to connect it and here's another birdhouse one and again just strips just some strips on there and the birdhouse again and with the same ribbon I just tied it in a knot okay this one I made it to look like like a brick wall And this silly embellishment. I made I made these both of these embellishments years ago. And I, they've been hanging around on my stash forever. So aren't they cute? So this one here is with the the brick look. And this one is just a woven background. And so you can put the art trading card together with another embellishment. And that's what this is to show. Putting two embellishments together. Alrighty, so I hope you like these ideas and you'll give at least one of them a try. So, and if you're liking these videos, please keep giving me those thumbs up. I really do appreciate it and it really does help me to know if you want to do part eight because we're almost there. Alrighty, so until we meet again, happy crafting. Bye-bye.